Hi, it's Sean Coast Mesa R&D. Well, today we have some uh, little screws here that we're going to modify. I'm making up a new uh, tool for our CNC milling machine so it can do sleeves a little bit more efficiently. And this is what the cutter head looks like. I'll go up into a uh, Cat 40 holder. And uh, anyway, there's a screw that goes in the end here to make the adjustments for adjusting the size. And what we did was we started out with a 5 16 fine thread bolt. We cut the head off and now we need to take and cut some holes in here so that we can adjust this thing. So I'm going to show you how that's done using a simple little spin indexer here. Uh, this is a real handy little tool, especially for you guys that are home machinists. Uh, it works really well. I'm going to load up the part here, and you don't have to be real critical as far as the X direction, the Y direction, you do need to get that centered. I'm going to bring our tool down, and then we'll make a small adjustment here to get the hole so that it's centered here in the middle, and that looks pretty good. And now what we'll do is we'll take our countersink and touch off and we're going to zero out our Z on the machine and we'll zero out the X. Alright, now we're going to be drilling down about 150 thousandths from this point. I've reset my X so that, uh, or my Z rather, so that I can come down to the same point. Now on the back side of this indexer, it's graduated in degrees. And what we're going to be doing here is we're going to be turning this thing from zero over to 90. We're going to shove our pin back in. there and what I've done here to speed myself up a little bit is I've taken a uh, marker and put a little mark right here at 90 degrees one at 0, one at 90, 180 and 270 so it's going to be a little bit faster to do this job okay now we're going to proceed with this thing
we're back to zero now. Go ahead and take this out. Pull it off a little bit. And as you can see, I have my holes in there. And that will make adjusting this thing a little bit easier. Anyway, if you have questions about spin indexers, give me a call here at Costa Mesa R&D. We'll see you soon.